Okay, so the nifty thing here is that it does let you load the levels that you're at. So I guess I'm in light. And by the way, amazing game guy. Amazing. I don't know if like he's doing the voice acting or he got someone else too, but the voice acting is actually pretty good. Okay, so let me look around here. I can't move forward is the thing. And I feel like this kind of looks like a train leg, like what Igor is talking about. But there's no way, because I can move forward, back, left and right, right? And I know that when the world gills kind of topsy-turvy, this switches. So, like, sometimes it's above me and sometimes it's under me. So I think I need to actually, maybe even if I fall off. But because my controls are actually cooperating with me right now, I'm going to try and just get across the bridge since I kept falling off. <laughs> So first I'll try and get across this bridge, now that my controls aren't so wonky. And then if I can get across this bridge, hopefully see and catch up to where Igor's at so we can keep going. Because that boy, he's full of spoilers. <laughs> he doesn't mind spoilers, like he does not give a crap if I tell him what's coming up. But if he tells me even like a sentence, I just feel like the experience is no longer pure. <laughs> I need to get to his level of chill, but that will never, ever happen. Okay, don't despair, but I'm despairing a little bit. We got Corona. I'm still having to go to work at the office. They're bringing some people into our office. Uh, not new people, but I think I either assume people who are working from home or they were furloughed, however you call it. But there's more people in the office now. It's not crowded, I think, still probably. Yeah, there's probably... I mean, we're still spaced out pretty well. But if someone does come into that one giant room, even if we're like sitting um, some spaces apart and they have it and they're coughing and sneezing, then we're all going to get it. And we all have the capability to work from home, like... I legit straight up to the boss I was like hey like I have to be around like a high-risk person and he just pretty much looked at me like well fuck you like too bad like we don't have the equipment to send you home which is bullcrap because there's plenty of people who they offered to send home who are still in the office Woo. and I, they just chose to come into the office. That's pr their prerogative, you know, as long as the doors are open. They don't want to work from home or they can't. So, like, give me the equipment that you were offering to give to them and let me work from home. Okay. Ooh. Oh, I did it. Okay. Venting my frustrations helped me get to this. Okay. I think I just, the problem was I just kept falling off the bridge and I'm a doofus. There we go. Woo, I'm on the train. Yeah! Oh, I did it. I think literally just having a pounding migraine was just making this level impossible. This is not a well-lit train. It feels like that scene from Penny Dreadful. Oh, I guess I can move, right? Can I? Yeah, okay. I'm enjoying this train ride. This is what I picture that little train like in... Shoot. What's that movie? That Ghibli movie? Oh, yeah. I think... <laughs> that cool! Not cool! <laughs> ah! Jump scared me. can't see but I'm gonna keep going I said to keep going I can't see crap but I'm gonna keep going what the heck am I walking through I see like little eyes you know little creepy children get out of my way 
This is like that Ghibli movie with the floaty ghosts in the train. God, what's that movie called? I am brain farting spirited away. There we go. I did it! This was, um, when I streamed on his, this is where he got to, so I guess I'll stop here. And hopefully this stops me at this level, but otherwise, okay, I figured it out. <laughs> my head's not pounding like crazy, thanks to my coworker who gave me, like, actual pills. I've been taking ibuprofen, apparently. <laughs> Shocker, that does not work for migraines. So, yeah, I'm here. Now I just gotta wait for my honey pie to wake up, my honey skillet. And we're gonna tackle this game. Oh yeah. Just as an aside, though, I just got an achievement. Because I was trying to quit the game. And, like, obviously here, I'm blind. And I can't see if there's an exit. Because I want to make sure there's a level here that's going to get saved. But I did the Alt F4. Let me see if it does it again. Yeah, no escape. <laughs> that's why I thought we were talking about that afterwards. Because, um... When he said, oh, the controls were changed because you gave permissions. I was like, oh, like right at the beginning when it says Alt F4, I bet if you push that, like something happens. And he's like, yeah, you're probably right. And yep, I am 100% certifiably right. Okay. 